Ender, our largest community, Vandenberg County. Now health officials here are rethinking as they assess the impact of the new Indiana restrictions on the River City. 44 News reporter Valerie Lyons explains the next steps are vital to the county getting out of the orange zone. Yeah, health officials are actually still waiting on that executive order from the governor's office. They say they expect to have it by tomorrow, and when they do, they'll start working with the rest of the county in determining how to implement these new restrictions. After several days with counts crossing the 100 case mark, Vanderburg County, one of Indiana's hardest hit communities, now classified as orange on the state's color coded map. Over the last two weeks, um, from uh, the, the 24th of uh, October through the 6th of the November, uh, there were 1,250 new cases. And with the governor's latest executive order placing new restrictions on gatherings in orange and red counties, Vanderburg will follow the new mandate. I think we treat everybody the same. If, if later on <clears throat> they relax, obviously we can relax too. But right now we have the backing of the governor to stay at 50. Uh, and uh, no more. While the Board of Health says the new limit on social gatherings is the right choice, they think the county needs to do even more. We need to make an awareness campaign, the six foot distancing, uh, wear your mask, wash your hands, use your hand sanitizer, and then if we can, we would like to start our own uh, contact tracing locally. Officials say right now they don't know of any specific events causing the surge in cases across the county, and that's because many of those testing positive are not completing their contact tracing. 65% of these, uh, these folks aren't completing their, their initial interviews, which is very difficult and makes it hard for us to gather uh, better data uh, to provide to not only local government leadership, but the board uh, to try to you know make make some sound decisions. The board hopes through improved contact tracing, the community will be better able to control the spread of the virus. In Evansville, Valerie Lyons, 44 News. And the board hopes through improved contact tracing, the community will be better able to control the spread of the virus. Reporting live in Evansville, Valerie Lyons, 44 News.